Hey guys, so this is going to be a smaller Dollar Tree haul. Today is Mother's Day, so happy Mother's Day to all of you mommies out there. Or daddies, grandmothers that act as mommies. I hope you guys have an awesome day. So this isn't the largest Dollar Tree haul, but some of these items will be given away for Mother's Day. So I wanted to be able to show them to you before I actually give them away. So the first item that I have to show you guys is one of the framed art pieces from Dollar Tree and I apologize for the glare it says but first coffee and then it's got the pretty coffee mug with black and white and the pretty flowers and then it's got this kind of um, golden frame on it this is gonna go into Jordan's mom's gift basket that I'm putting together for her this morning the next item that I have to show your items <clears throat> are these wall decals and these are the Disney Princess wall decals. I got two of them. I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to do. Sorry, guys. Not exactly sure what I'm going to do with these, but this type of stuff goes really quickly, at least at our Dollar Tree. So it has Cinderella, Ariel, and then it's got Belle on it with all the little characters on the side. So one of them I will probably gift to someone, and then the other one will go in my beauty room. Or maybe I can do a craft with it. <clears throat> the next item that I got was a pack of these LED flower lights. It's in the Luminescence brand. You get two of them and it says you get a total of 120 hours. I've purchased these exact, sorry, exact, I cannot talk this morning, exact LED flowers before. And I actually got these to somehow incorporate into one of the Mother's Day gift baskets because... Flowers are just pretty for Mother's Day, so I got those. I believe they have those in pink, white, and maybe red, but I could be wrong. <clears throat> the next item that I have to show you guys, if you like Star Wars or sci-fi, is this Zach brand Star Wars cup. And we have an in-display up by the registers, and it's got... Um, Coffee mugs and piggy banks. This is a really good deal for a dollar. These would make nice gifts to give to someone. There's the bottom that says Star Wars and then Zach. Zach is normally a brand that you see at Walmart. So this would probably be like around $5. I was going to get one of each of the mugs and the piggy banks. The only reason I didn't get the piggy banks is because Jordan has his computer desk in our living room. And I could just see the Star Wars piggy bank ending up on his desk in my living room and I don't want Star Wars decor in my living room. So the next items that I got are nothing super exciting or new but I really love these hand soaps and while they continue to get them at Dollar Tree I will continue to purchase them. So I got um, two, I don't know which ones I got two of but um, I got two of one and then one of the other two. So there's peony and plum, jasmine and mint, wild basil and lime, and then the hand wash plus lotion in the orchid, orchid and coconut milk. These are each eight ounces. And this one, you can tell that there's lotion in it. It is moisturizing to the hands. So definitely keep an eye out for those because they are a good quality soap. And for a dollar... You can't beat that. Those would probably be like two eighty nine or around three bucks if you were to get them at Target or Walmart. The next item that I got was this galvanized um, bucket, like planter bucket or flower bucket. It's got the jute twine around the top, so you could easily just get a galvanized bucket and then hot glue the jute twine at the top, but. This saves you the money from purchasing the jute twine and gluing it because it's already on there. I have to purchase another plant or flowers, so I may use this for the Mother's Day plant or flowers depending on the size that I get. The next items that I got were these t-shirts, and I honestly just picked them up. I didn't even look at the sizes, and they are huge. So I might actually exchange the first two that I'm going to show you. So I got this bright blue one, and these were just going to be for like lounging around the house, pajamas, stuff like that. And then I got this gray one, 
and the gray one is a 3XL. So I showed them to Jordan, and he was like, babe, those are way too huge. So these two I might exchange. If not, they'll just be for pajamas. This one I'm going to keep. I got this for myself. It's in this bright mango color. It's just in the size large, and it's the Comfort Colors brand. I would just wear this with, like, a pair of yoga pants or activewear pants around the house if I'm not doing anything with, like, a pair of sliders. So I got that. Let me see what else is down here. I picked up this card for Jordan to give to his mom. Yes, he should be picking out his own cards, but I knew he probably wouldn't. So this is the Hallmark brand, and I actually swapped out the pink envelope for this bright yellow envelope. I just think it looks really nice with the yellow envelope, and this card is really pretty. So as you know, we have the two-for-one Hallmark cards at Dollar Tree, and then we have the cards that are a dollar each. This was one of the one dollar cards. It says, love you mom. And it's got the really pretty flowers. And I just love that vibrant yellow. The inside says, you give so much of yourself every day in the kindness you show to those around you and to the whole family. That's why you deserve a heartfelt thank you for all the ways you brighten your corner of the world with your love. Happy Mother's Day. I thought that was very fitting for Jordan's mom. She's a nurse and she's always helping people. So, And I like the fact that they incorporated the flowers onto the inside. The original price of this card, as you can see, would be $3.89, so a dollar for that is a great deal. And I actually got her my own card, which I think I may have shown you guys. I picked up this picture frame, which is probably going to go in Jordan's mom's gift basket. I wanted to go to CVS and... Um, you can take your chip out of your phone, put it into the machine, and then print out whatever pictures you want. I wanted to get a picture of, like, maybe Jordan and his mom, or all of us, and put it on this. I just thought this looked like a nice kind of farm fresh type frame. So it's got the little clip where you clip the picture, so there's no glass involved. There's that. Jordan's mom loves... The turquoise blue color. That's like her favorite color. She's got lots of that color in her house. And I actually even really like these candle holders. I don't do tons of this color, but I do think it's pretty. And it's got the ombre silver on the bottom. Tell me those are not super pretty, you guys. So I got those to incorporate into her gift basket. And I don't know if I already said this in this video or not, but I had picked out a bright turquoise blue a bucket at Dollar Tree to put her gift in and it was this exact same color I ended up leaving it there and I'm so mad because I wanted everything to be you know based off of this color so I don't know if we go that way I might pick it up but I'm not sure so I got those I got these two candles to put in there as well these kind of remind me of the what is it called? Is it like milk? Sorry guys, I'm trying to grab the other one. I know I'm bouncing the camera around. It's like milk glass or something like that. And I love the intricate detail on these candles. I actually purchased um, some that were like this. And I just got them for the actual look of them. I'm not going to burn the candle. But the scent, if you're interested on these candles, is it says Aloha Bay scented candle and these are three ounces each so i'm not sure of the throw on these candles or anything like that so here's all of those <clears throat> kind of blue items there's those let's see i picked up i think three of these russell stover strawberry cream candies to put into the gift baskets I don't see the third one. Hope Jordan did not eat it. I bet you anything he opened the third one and ate it. So this is 2.95 ounces each, and these are really good. I've had them. They have a different assortment of the Russell Stover chocolates. They have, like, chocolate with peanut butter, dark chocolate with coconut, just lots of different ones. They even have, like, a lemon 
truffle type one and my boss Melissa said they were like really good she said the texture of them was really good but they didn't have any of the lemon ones or else I would have also got lemon because I think to put some yellow ones with this um, turquoise color in her basket would have been really nice so I actually messed up the chocolate for the chocolate covered strawberries yesterday so I don't know if I'm gonna go get more chocolate today to redo them but if not, then those chocolates will have to suffice. I picked up these bulbs to go into Jordan's mom's gift basket. So as you can see, a lot of this stuff is going in Jordan's mom's gift basket. So this is the six-pack of the gladioli bulbs. And it says easy to grow. That's what they look like. And she loves gardening, so I know she'll plant these. Then they had, oh no, here's the third one, so Jordan didn't eat it. You guys know they have at Dollar Tree these little seed packs, and they say 99 cents on each one, but they're actually four for a dollar, at least at Dollar Tree. So I tried to pick out um, all different pretty flowers. So I got a pack of the marigold flowers. The Morning Glory, which I didn't notice that they were both um, Morning Glories, but they have different colors on there. So I don't know if they'll come out those colors. And then a pack of the Cosmos to put in her gift basket because I know she'll love these as well. I was almost going to do an entire garden-themed gift basket for her, but... I don't know, just a lot of the gardening stuff at my Dollar Tree was out, and I didn't want to have her gift basket with, like, barely anything in it as far as gardening goes. They were completely out of baby wipes at my Dollar Tree, and we really needed them, so I just picked up this pack of the Sesame Street Flushable Toddler Wipes. They actually feel pretty thick, you guys, so I don't know, I might like these, because the Dollar Tree brand baby wipes... I only get them for convenience when they're out. They're so thin, you guys. Like, you have to get, like, three of them or else they just, I don't know, shred. So I got those. They're made in the USA, so that's a plus. Okay, so I think that may be everything from Dollar Tree. Oh, with the exception of... Nope, there's two more things. I got a couple packs of this toilet paper, which I always tell you just until I can get to Walmart. We go through toilet paper so much. This is, it just says bath tissue, bath tissue, sorry, strong and soft two-ply. You get 240 sheets per roll, and it's 106.7 square feet of toilet paper. I got two of these liquid dish soaps. And right now they have the limited time bonus size. So this is 16 ounces. It says 25% more. I guess they're normally the 12.6 ounces. And I wouldn't normally go for this scent. This is the apple pear. But because of the size, I decided to go ahead and get it. So now I think that's everything from Dollar Tree. But I wanted to show you guys... Three items from Ross. I actually went to Ross yesterday hoping to find some nice items to throw into the Mother's Day gift baskets, but they were so low on everything, which I guess would be expected the day before Mother's Day. <clears throat> but one thing I did get to put in Jordan's mom's gift basket is this really pretty, um, I don't know, it's like, I guess, to put water in for birds or decorative piece for your garden. It was $5.99. It's actually really heavy duty, and it's the perfect color to match um, the turquoise color that I'm going for. It's not exact, but it looks really nice, and I know she's going to love that. I actually wanted to keep it for myself again, but I can't do that. So then my Grammy really loves sunflowers, and they had these jars with sunflowers painted on them and these were only $2.99 you guys I thought that was a really good deal it's pretty heavy duty I don't know exactly <clears throat> what she would do with it but I'm just gonna fill it up with maybe candy or something like that and then the final thing that I got from Ross and this is actually for our house is this kitchen concept set of 
two ice cube trays with no spill lids because we've purchased many of different ice cube trays and they always end up cracking and I like the fact that these have lids on them so after you fill them up you don't have to balance them to the freezer. Our refrigerator has <clears throat> an ice maker. <clears throat> It has an ice maker and a water dispenser. The water dispenser works, but the ice maker, I don't know if it's not hooked up or it's broke, which is very common on refrigerators. The ice makers always go out first. So, I know that was kind of a uh, small haul, like I said, but I hope you enjoyed it nonetheless. I know I bounce around with my camera and you don't see me. I do it in first person. I had someone comment and ask why would I ever film a video um, where you can't see me and the camera's bouncing around and I'm just thinking, she said nobody would want to watch it and I'm thinking, well you're wrong because there are, are a lot of people that watch my videos. I know they're not the best edited videos, but I'm here to show you guys the items so you guys can find them. So. I ha hope you guys once again have a great Mother's Day, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.